Well, you know, talking about chemistry, I mean, uh, when you get together, when you are paired together for chamber music festivals, and you've never played with the person, you don't necessarily know if it's going to work or not. You just try it for the fun of it, for the hell of it, and uh, if it doesn't work well, you know, you make it work as best you can. But if it, if you really feel a, a, a terrific sympathy, you know, then then there's nothing like it, of course. I think from the very beginning, we felt very sympathetic together. But uh, I think that over time it has grown. Um, we uh, just a couple of days ago we saw um, someone who had heard us doing it in 2012, the, the, the Rite of Spring specifically, and just hearing it now, he said the leaps and bounds have been huge hmm. in the, uh, the, our rapport with the piece and, and how we get it across. And that's not some, something that we necessarily notice immediately, but you know, the piece has been lived in and, and uh, I guess it's breathing in a different way and we, um, yeah. What are we doing differently? I don't know. I mean, it's, I'm not it's sure simply either. the experience of, of doing it. It's such a, it's such a journey mm -hmm. um, that sometimes these things take time. I, I, something about two piano playing, I, I think, because neither of us are really, really used to it. I mean, like, like any two piano team would do just only that, would be. Uh, I think it, there's an added feeling of security over time mm -hmm. that gets reinforced with each performance. And that's important. That's true. I mean, to, to be in a musical partnership where you, you know, after years of playing together, you feel you can really trust. Um, that's, uh, there's nothing better than that on stage.